Hello everybody, it's me, Max. Today, I brought along my good friend, Boo. What are we doing today, Max? Well, I don't know yet, but let's go to the lookout and find out. Sound good? Sound good. All right, let's go. Max and Boo, your mission today is to take Peppa Pig's little brother, George, to go see some dinosaurs. He loves dinosaurs. So make sure you go and teach him as much about them as you can. But Max and Boo, please keep them safe. All right, Boo. So we got our mission. We need to take George here and show him some dinosaurs. Wow. He really wants to. So let's go ahead and get the first dinosaur. Where are the dinosaurs? I think they're just around back here. Do oh. you want to grab the first dinosaur? Oh, that's so silly. Okay, that that is just a that is not a real dinosaur. Boom. Oh, not a real dinosaur. That is Yoshi. He's a Nintendo dinosaur, but he's not actually a real dinosaur. Oh. Uh, Can we get a real dinosaur? Sure. Oh, that is a good dinosaur. I don't know much about that one. Do you think we should ask the narrator? I know about it. Okay, do you tell us about it. It's a T-Rex. Oh, very nice. What else do we know about it? Well, the thing is, T-Rex has a very short Very good. They use that for chomps, like rocks and stuff. Rocks? Mm-hmm. I think we should ask the narrator. What do you think? I uh, sure. Okay, just the narrator. Well, the T-Rex is a carnivore. <laughs> Do you know what a carnivore is, Boo? No, a carnivore means that a T-Rex eats meat. Yeah, and the T-Rex is can grow to be 42 feet long. Whoa. And the T-Rex can run 25 miles an hour. Whoa. And can weigh up to 14,000 pounds. Oh my gosh, 14,000 pounds! That's a lot. That is a very lot. Oh my gosh, that is a very, very big dinosaur. Only thing I know about the T-Rex is it's it's probably the most well-known dinosaur there is. What do you think, Boo? Everyone knows the T-Rex, right? Yeah. I think so. George, are you happy that we showed you a T-Rex? Dinosaur? Yes, he seems very happy. Yeah, he's, he seems really happy that we showed him. Well, you're welcome, George. Okay. Let's get rid of the T-Rex, and let's get our next dinosaur out. It is a Stegosaurus! A Stegosaurus? What do we know about the Stegosaurus, Boo? Oh, I know about some of it. Okay. That they have spikes, and they, and they're, and they're, and they are, uh, but all dinos stand on four legs or two legs. So this one stands on four legs, and um, it's pretty much big. That is very cool. Mr. Narrator, some more information, please. Oh, and they have purple tongues. <laughs> I like it. The Stegosaurus is an herbivore. What is an herbivore? Great question, Boo. It is an herbivore, meaning it eats only plants. Ooh, yeah. And those things all over its back are covered, are called plates. Plates? Yeah. And they can grow to be 15 feet long Six and a half feet tall. I know. And 6,800 pounds. Is that a lot? Max, that's a lot, right? That is a lot. And they can run only five miles an hour. They're actually pretty slow. That's not That's not particularly fast. Max, what do you think? I, I think that they look very cool. I like the plates on their back. Um, and they're not very fast, so they're not that intimidating. Also, I like the fact that it's an herbivore because that way I know he will not eat me. I'm just happy it doesn't have fair teeth. Yes, he doesn't look like, this particular one doesn't look like he has any teeth. I don't know, did they normally not have teeth? Dinosaur. I don't think even an elevator does. Look, George is riding it. George is riding it. He's done riding it. Okay, George, what do you say we go to the next dinosaur? Dinosaur? <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know much about this one. 
Well, first of all, that one is on a skateboard, and I'm pretty sure that dinosaurs don't typically ride skateboards, but this one is... Let's find out from Mr. Narrator what kind of dinosaur that is. I don't know. So let's start. That one is a Pacal Pachycephalosaurus. What? I know, that is a mouthful. And there is also an herbivore. It has no teeth either. Mm -hmm. And they can weigh almost a thousand pounds. Whoa. Okay, another very big guy. Are they, they're all very big. And it's skateboards. And that one skateboards, so I think he's quite cool. There's not much more to say about that one. Oh, looks like George likes the skateboard too. What dinosaur. do you say about that, George? I have dinosaur. Okay, let's go ahead and get our next dinosaur. I'll tell you what, and I'll tell you what type of one it is. It's a triceratops. Ooh, a triceratops! It has three horns. Count them for me. One, two, three. One, two, three! Three horns! Very cool. This is Mr. Narrator. Okay, Mr. Narrator. Alright, that is a triceratops, also an herbivore. And what does that mean again, Boo? That's okay, Boo. It means that it only eats plants. Oh! It, as you already pointed out, it has three horns on its head. It can be seven and a half feet tall, 24 feet long. That is really long. And can weigh between 13 and 26,000 pounds. And George is riding it. And George is riding it. And can run 20 miles an hour. Hold on, George. Oh my gosh, George! Hold on! And don't fall and hurt yourself on one of those horns. That would that would not be good because we are responsible for you today. Okay, it looks like we're done with Triceratops. Oh, it looks like I have a message. Sorry to interrupt, but Max, you need to go practice your letters. Next, it's time to practice my letters. And to help us with our letters, I have brought with me Marshall. And today's letter is the letter D, which is perfect because Marshall is a dog, which begins with the letter D. But he's also a Dalmatian, and Dalmatian begins with the letter D. So let's start by doing the uppercase D. Press the line, and then we go out come back into the line, uppercase D, and a lowercase D, and a circle, and the line goes up, uppercase D, and a lowercase D. Let's go ahead and look at some D words now. We have a door. Do you have a door on your bedroom? Probably. Ooh, dessert. I love dessert. Do you like dessert? What is your favorite dessert? Mine is ice cream and cookies. I love cookies too. Ooh, desk. Do you have a desk at school? You probably will. Ooh, dinosaur. I love dinosaurs. What is your favorite dinosaur? I love the T-Rex. Oh, a dump truck. Dump trucks are fun to play with. Toy dump trucks, that is. Dolphins. I love dolphins. I would love to swim with a dolphin one day. Oh, a duck. I like to watch the duck swim around in the pond. And a dragonfly. Have you ever seen a dragonfly for real? Sometimes I get scared when I see a dragonfly. And I know they don't sting you, but they still scare me sometimes. Okay, I think that's it with the letters. Let's get back to playing. Great job, Max. Now go finish the mission. And we are back. <laughs> I'll get the next dino. Next dino. It's gonna be fun. Oh, no. I know. Look at that one. I 
I like this one, but I am going to tell you all about it. Tell me all about it. Okay, so it is a twin dawn. It's the only, and it is the only dino with wings. It has hands too. That is very neat. And a beak and a feather on its head. And it does not, and it, and it does not have teeth either. That is a very, you know a lot about the Dranodon. Mm -hmm. Do you know how fast it can fly? Oh, it just, it flies a bit slow and about, and about a little bit far. Maybe we should ask the narrator. Yeah. Mr. Narrator! The Pteranodon can actually fly 70 miles an hour. Whoa! Yes, it is impressive, Boo. And the Pteranodon is a carnivore. It only eats plants. No, that's an herbivore. Oh. What's a carnivore eat? Only plants. Meat. Meat. <laughs> only eats meat. Enjoy these writings. They can be six feet tall, weigh 44 pounds, with a wingspan of 25 to 50 feet. Whoa. That's pretty impressive. Hold on, George. That looks scary. Oh my gosh, George! <laughs> George, this is, this is ridiculous. Please return him safely to Mr. Tyranodon. Okay. Woo! That was scary. <laughs> Next dinosaur, please. It has spikes on its back, so I bet George is not going to be riding this one. It has spikes on its back. Do you know the name of that dinosaur, Boo? No, I actually don't. Should we ask the narrator? Yes. Mr. the narrator. Please. That one is an Ankylosaurus. It is, can be, it's also an herbivore, which means You got it, Boo. The uh, it can be five and a half feet tall, twenty point twenty and a half feet long, weigh up to twelve thousand pounds, and can run at six miles an hour. Whoa! And George is on it, and he has spikes. Be careful, George! George, you are scaring me. Does he know that we are responsible for him today? This is very scary. He's running on the backwards! Please stop! Oh no! Okay, please return! The dinosaurs caught him! Please return, George! Okay! That was a very nice dinosaur. He helped us. There's two more dinosaurs that are the same. Bring those ones together! They're the same kind, but I don't know what they are. One of them looks like it had been chewed on by a dog. It is. Okay, that one was chewed on by a dog. That is not good. Okay, so the one on the right is not been chewed on by a dog, and both of them. Well, I don't know. Let's ask the narrator. I don't know either. So let's. They are both Brachiosaurus. Whoa! Brachiosaurus are herbivores, which once again, boo means. They only eat plants. Very good. And they're both. And they're, they're very very tall, and they feed on the high tall leaves. Kind of like giraffes do. They can be 50 feet tall, 100 feet long, weigh 60 tons, and go 10 miles an hour. Whoa! Okay, that is enough, George. Bye. George, were you happy that you, with our day of meeting dinosaurs? I just want to say goodbye to them. But I had fun. I had so much fun. I wish I never had to leave. And I'm. But before we leave, I want to say goodbye to them. Goodbye. 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 See you soon. Oh wait, nap time. Oh no, it's nap time. Ah! <laughs> Oh, okay. okay. Well, I think that concludes our day with the dinosaurs. Is our mission complete? Bye, everyone. Bye. High five, boo. Good times. Yeah, good times.